Hey guys, this is Miss Lackey from Your Saber Library. Today I'm going to show you an awesome resource you have available to you called Hoopla. In order to access your Hoopla accounts from the public library, we're actually going to start at the Saber Library website. In order to get there, you can type in bit.ly slash Saber Library or you can get there from the home page. It's also probably bookmarked on your Chromebook. So once you're at the Saber Library website, you're going to click where it says One Access. When you click on One Access, it's actually going to take you to the high school landing page um, for One Access. And if you scroll to the very bottom, you're going to see an option that says Hoopla. When you click on that, it takes you to a brief description of what it offers you. Again, this is all the stuff that your teachers already told you um, and some awesome resources completely for free um, to each of you every month. So in order to get into your account, you're going to scroll to the bottom and click where it says Access Now. If for some reason when you click Access Now, it's asking you for your library card number, remember it is just your student ID number. If it's asking for a pen, that is your four-digit birth year. Uh, so on mine, it's just asking me and taking me straight to the Hoopla homepage. I already have an account, but for most of you, you don't have an account yet. So today we're going to set up our accounts using our CMS student ID. Um, so you're going to click here where it says Get Started Today. When you click that, it's going to ask you to put an email address in. Most people put in their CMS student email. You're more than welcome to use a personal one. Uh, then you're also going to create a password. I'd create a password that you're going to remember, and then you hit the Agree button. For those of you that have created accounts, you can actually go ahead and click the login button and log in with the information that you used. Once you're there, it's going to take you to your home page. It's going to show you at the top how many checkouts you still have for the month. I still have six. It's going to show you under the My Hoopla section um, what you currently have borrowed and things that you can favorite uh, to save for later. And then you can also browse. Right now I'm just browsing in the audiobooks, but again, you have options for movies, music, comics, ebooks, even television. All stuff that you can stream straight to your Chromebook as long as you have a Wi Fi connection. Again, this is Hoopla. Hopefully, you were able to access your accounts. If not, just make sure your teacher emails me uh, so I can make sure I can get your account up and running. Again, this was Miss Lackey from your Saber Library.